in the days when Daniel was thrown into the lion's den and they said surely he shall be consumed and eaten devoured by the lions and in the days when three Hebrew boys were thrown into a fiery furnace turned up seven times hotter and in the times when a whole nation Israel says the Spirit of God stood upon the shores pursued by Pharaoh and his army what would Daniel do what would Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego do? What would the nation of Israel do? And now I speak to you, United States. When the Poles, they speak, they lie, they prognosticate. What shall you do? The Spirit of God says, remember Daniel. Remember Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego. Remember the nation of Israel where there was no place to go. What did I do? God says, I intervened. And what they have counted out is I have cast my vote, says the living God. Therefore, you shall celebrate a victory of my choice. He shall stand in the land again, says the living God. Shout! Shout! Your divine intervention, your supernatural intervention. Come on. How many believe that if God, as He just said, can deliver Daniel, He can deliver Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, He can deliver Israel when they had no place to go, but the waters parted, the sea opened. Come on, the enemy was defeated. The lying spirits, come on, those who are lying and speaking lies shall be consumed as God shall open the way and a divine intervention out of heaven is coming that shall give this nation another chance, a new era shall continue. Come on, shout it if you believe it. Divine intervention, divine intervention divine intervention come on divine intervention of the living god the hand of the lord almighty come on thank you lord thank you lord thank you lord father we pray for the senate we pray for the house you have not spoken specifically about the senate and the house but father this is my prayer how can your man stand again in the land without the senate so it seems to me that it shall fall into divine place. But oh, the house, the house shall continually be shaken. And not everyone who is seated now shall be unseated. For there shall come evidence, there shall come information, there shall come exposure that shall remove them from their seats in another time. Establish your order, God. Establish your way. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done. On earth! Over this nation as it is in heaven, we declare over this election. And I speak those words, and those words will not be altered or changed. Father, I pray for the people. Everyone in this room, and those of you that are watching around the world. That same intervention that God has promised, that He said He already had brought to, what He say, Daniel and Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego into the nation of Israel, into this nation right now, United States. Come on, maybe you're facing something, those of you that are watching. You have the right, as a child of the living God, to divine intervention. As the polls speak, as the fake news prognosticates and lies with a lying spirit in their mouth on purpose they're doing it you have forgotten one thing you have forgotten God's hand of intervention that shall make you look like a fool listen I, I hear a correction from God some of you are speaking too much fear and it has grieved the spirit of God 
Some of you that are watching, you, ha- you are speaking and you are believing the lie that somehow this nation shall not go forward and that it shall be in chaos and disorder. And you are listening to people who've had dreams and visions. Listen to me. Why do you speak the plans of the enemy and give it a voice? Do you not remember the hand of God that intervenes and delivers? Who and what have you put your trust in? My trust is in God. Therefore, he shall prevail and he shall intervene. Come on, give God one more shout. 